Okay, here we go. I finally got one of these. This is an akbuilder.com AK47, AK74 receiver flat bending die. I have been waiting a long time to get one of these. But uh, finally did. Builder.com. They got some really good shit. And if you ever get one of these, make sure you read these. These are the instructions for this fantastic piece of equipment. But uh, you don't want to fuck up a $180 piece of equipment. But, uh, yeah, it's, uh, like I said, it's been a long time coming, and it's got, it can bend 7.62 by 39, or 5.45 5 by 39 receiver flats, and it just depends to bend a 7.62 flat. You can leave all four of those tabs up. The 5-4-5 five, five flat, you need to push the two top pins down. So they're flush with the top of this die here. And then it has, it has these holes right here that the machine screws hold the flat down when you're pressing it. And screws are in there. And then these recess holes right here are for them screws to line up in as you're pressing your flat. Make sure these are lined up because you'll fuck it up. Sure as shit. But but yeah these all this right here weighs about about 18 to 20 pounds so it, it's a uh, fairly chunky set of metal. But anyway, I am going to attempt to make a 545 by 39 flat into a receiver. But I just wanted to go over this. I'm excited because I finally got one of these things. And uh, But anyway, see ya. And this right here is my Harbor Freight 12 ton shop press that I will be bending my flats on with the AK Builder flat bending die. And uh, I've been waiting on one of these also. My income is uh, fairly tight and I'm on a tight budget so Getting this stuff is uh, pretty fucking exciting for me. But anyway, I am going to get everything set up and ready to roll, and I will be back. Okay, here are my also akbuilder.com receiver flats. And I have two separate flats here. This one right here is for a, a Bulgarian AK-74 side folder. So I'm not going to be bending this one right away because I'm still waiting on a side folder. But uh, anyway, it comes with the, the rails. And none of this is heat treated, so you will have to heat treat it after, after you get it 
formed and it's recommended that you drill all your holes prior to heat treating. Uh, there's a few of these holes on here that are that you need to ream out to the correct size. They are not full size because they kind of distort since they're so close to the edge where it's bent. And uh, you don't want to fuck them up. This right here is the die or the flat that I will be bending. This is uh, this is a fixed stock Bulgarian 545 by 39 flat, and these also come with rails. And this is also akbuilder.com flat. Um, the Tapco flats I haven't tried them, but they they do not fit as nicely in the AK Builder flat bending die. Um, you kind of need a set of calipers to line them up and everything. These have the holes and the tabs and they just sit right in there and it's just really easy with these flats. And then with the, the flats Anyway, there's uh, rivet sets in here and center support uh, according to, you know, whichever flat that uh, you purchase. These cost separate, so if you do order these, make sure you order these along with your flat uh, because the only thing that comes with these flats is uh, the rails. This guy's right here. But anyway, it's a little bit more of my excited evening. But anyway, I shall be back. Okay, and like I mentioned earlier, these two front tabs right here need to be pushed down. When you're doing a 5, 4, 5 by 39 flat. So just kind of push those down. And you know, it's going to take a little bit more than that. Okay, I got these tabs right there pushed down. And now I can. Put my flat on there and she'll be right back.